hello everyone hello good day and welcome and welcome back to my channel guys so if you're new welcome to my channel and today as you can see this is our project okay that i'm going to share with you guys just making this granny square okay out of this beautiful okay uh flower motif okay so or flower pattern and um this is very very simple okay so if you guys interested stay tuned and and let's get started okay guys so we are going to start with our project so we're going to start with the slip knot so hold so this is our tail hold your yarn like that the tail is in your left and then make a loop like this so you just like wrap like that so this is on the top okay so you make a circle and then you hold this and then pull this and tight and tight it up okay so from here we are going to chain six one two three four five six <clears throat> and we are going to slip stitch into the first chain that we made okay so insert your hook and then pull through both loops so we have our magic ring again from here we're going to chain one and then we have to pull like decent height okay because we're going to do our cluster okay so pull how high the height that you wanted okay and then we're going to wrap our yarn insert into the magic ring and pull up a loop and then pull to the height and yarn over and insert again and up and we have one two three four five and then from here we're going to yarn over and then pull through all five loops okay and then close it and we're going to chain two okay and then the same thing yarn over insert into the magic ring pull up a loop the same height as this one and yarn over pull up a loop okay and then we have one two three four five loops and yarn over and pull through all five loops and close it and chain two and prepare prepare for prepare pre, prepare for another cluster yarn over insert pull up a loop to the height yarn over insert pull up a loop to the height and we have five loops yarn over pull through all five loops and close chain two and continue pull up uh, stuck okay yarn over insert pull up to the height yarn over insert and pull up to the height and yarn over and pull through all the loops and close it and then chain two we need to complete eight spaces okay and pull up yarn over insert and pull up and five loops yarn over pull through all the loops and close and chain two okay and then to the next okay we need to continue until we have eight spaces 
and chain two so at the moment is we have one two three four five okay so this is our six pull through all the loops close and chain two okay and then continue it's two yeah, we'll pull through all the loops and close chain just our first two three four five six seven and this is our eight so we chain two and then into the the chain that you closed off is we're going to insert there and slip stitch okay so just make sure that you do have eight spaces so one two three four five six seven eight okay because we're going to work two spaces at a time okay so two spaces and then we make our corner two spaces corner two spaces corner two spaces corner okay so from here we are going to start in this space so we are going to slip another slip stitch another one more okay until we got into the space and then from here we're going to chain 10 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 okay and then we are going to wrap seven times. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Insert into the same space. And we are going to do our quadruple, triple crochet, I think. That's what you call it. Okay, so you're going to pull through two and yarn over pull through two and yarn over pull through two 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 and yarn over pull through two okay so we have two and then we chain one and then wrap seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Okay, insert in the same space. We're going to make four of these long strand. Okay, so yarn over, pull through two, then yarn over, pull through two. Yarn over, pull through two. Yarn over, pull through two. And yarn over, pull through two. Yarn over, pull through two. Yarn over, pull through two. And yarn over, pull through two. And chain one. Okay, and we are going to make our last one. One, two, three four five six and seven okay so insert in the same space pull up a loop okay and then from here yarn over pull through two so that's one two three four five six seven and eight okay and then we <clears throat> complete our first space okay and now we are going to chain four one two three four for a separation okay and then we're going to repeat this okay making four this time we need to make four we don't chain ten 
Okay, so we wrap seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Okay, we need to go to the next, next space. Yarn over, pull up a loop. Yarn over, pull through two. 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 And yarn over, pull through two. Yarn over, pull through two. And yarn over, pull through two. Okay, so that's our first chain one. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Okay, insert and pull up. And then yarn over, pull through one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Chain one, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Okay, insert into the same space. You're gonna pull up a loop. Okay, you're gonna pull through two. One, two, three, uh, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight okay so we have three chain one one two three four five six seven and insert into the same space pull up a loop okay so one two three four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay. And then we have completed. Now we're going to work into our corner. So as I mentioned before, we need to work two spaces okay for one corner and then make our corner okay and then we are going to chain one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve okay we have twelve and from here we're going to re uh, wrap seven times one two three four five six and seven okay and we're going to work on the next chain space okay so yarn over pull through two 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 and yarn over pull through two and pull through two and pull through the last two loops okay so this is our corner as you can see so this will be our corner so we're going to continue chain one one two three four five six and seven Okay, same space. Yarn over pull through two. 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 And two. Chain one to one two, three, four, five, six, 
seven. Okay, and insert. Okay, and you're gonna pull through. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Chain one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven okay in the same space pull up and you're gonna go one two three four five six seven and eight okay so we have this corner and now we have this first chain space, okay? And we have to make another set of four, okay? But then here we are going to chain four. One, two, three, four. This is the separation of the two. And we're going to wrap one, two, three, four, five, six and seven okay insert into the next chain space and here i will pull through two one two three and four five six seven and eight chain one one two three four five six seven okay into the space pull through two pull through two pull through two and pull through two pull through two pull through two pull through two and pull through two Chain one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and Chain one, one, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Is that correct? <clears throat> okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And into the, the same space, this is our last one. Okay, so you're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. <clears throat> so this is our first corner, and then we created two. And now we have to do the our corner, okay? So the next corner, which is we have to chain 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, okay? And then we are going to do this and this over here and over here. And then continue doing that, guys. Okay, so you have to repeat this, this two, okay? And then chain four when you finish one set of four, chain four. And then in the next is you have to do four as well. 
and then you have to create the the corner okay so you have to create the corner and then you have to create another corner because this is our second corner which is we have chain 12 so now one two three four five and six and seven okay and then we're going to work into the next chain space okay one two three four five six seven and eight chain one one two three four five six seven okay In the same space do our second one two three four five six seven eight one chain one one two three four five six seven okay into the space one two three four five six seven eight and nine. Oh, sorry eight sorry that's only eight okay so chain one then one two three four five six seven okay into the same space one two three four five six seven and eight okay so now we have our four set and we're going to make our chain four space okay and we're now we're going to work another four or the next space we need to work four again so one two three four five six seven okay and work one two three four five six seven and eight chain one one two three four five six seven and insert one two three four five six seven and eight okay chain one one two three four five six and seven okay the same space one two three four five six seven and eight you see we have three so chain one one two three four five six seven and insert one two three four five six seven and eight okay now we have completed okay so this is how it looks like at the moment okay so we have first corner 
and then the second corner so in every corner you have two or eight okay you have eight with a chain for separation so every chain one space you have four and you have two spaces in every corner and then you have to make your corner and then you have to complete your two spaces and for a total of eight and then you have to create another corner and another corner and this is the third corner okay so we have one two three okay so we have to the third and then we continue this and we are going to complete our four okay so now we are going to chain 12 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 okay and then we are going to do 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 okay and into the next chain space we are going to complete our 7 1 2 3 4 oh sorry okay so 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 so 1 2 three four five six okay so do that again sorry guys okay so one two three four five six and seven so one two three four five six seven and eight okay so we completed our next corner so one two and this is our third corner okay chain one one two three four five six seven and into the same space so one two three four five six seven and eight chain one one two three four five six seven one two three four five six seven and eight chain one okay and one more to complete our four our first space one two three four five six seven and one two three four five six seven and eight okay so this is how it looks like and then now we're going to make our four chain two three four and then one two three four five six seven okay and we're going to work into our last chain space okay so one two three 
four, five, six, seven, and eight. Chain one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Chain one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Go one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Chain one. Okay, so we have three. Okay, so this is our last one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so this is our last one. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, so if you were going to have a look at it, so this is how it looks like. Okay, so we have three corners, and then now we are going to complete our last corner, which is 12 chains. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and we are going to slip stitch. Okay. So we're going to skip one, okay, in here because we have a chain space. So we have to count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then that is the ten. So we are going to insert in the ninth space and leave one space. So then slip stitch and then chain one and you can cut your yarn okay so this is how it looks like okay so this is our uh, granny and this is our flower okay so this is like very cute okay so this is just how to create this and then you can make this like a big piece so i will work on that but this is gel this is just how you make this piece with the flower okay motif and i'm going to give you the measurement of this from one side to the other is 15 centimeter so this one will be 15 as well okay so that is 15 as well okay so 15 by 15 that is your granny square for this tutorial and that is very very cute okay so i can't wait to make this into a top okay and i'm very excited for that okay so what's out for that guys so for today's tutorial this is where we finish okay so thank you very much guys for tuning in and hopefully guys you like this video and if you do please um give this a big thumbs up and if you're new to my channel, please do um, subscribe if you like. Okay, so I'm trying to grow my channel. And 
at the moment I have every Monday and every Saturday, but I'm trying to upload more uh, for you guys. Okay, so hopefully guys, I'm going to see you in the next video. And have a great day, everyone. And thank you. And see you next time. Thanks, guys. Bye.